Hello, everyone, and welcome to piece 11 out of 12, Lemon. If you don't know what the challenge is about, do check the description below for information as well as tools that I use. Now, long story short, five out of seven commission deadlines has been pushed back. Thankfully, so I've been able to take somewhat of a break since the last video. I am, however, stuck on one commission, which is like, I can't make it work. So I f have to put so much effort into it. And then a logo concept that I'm still kind of in the planning phase of. It's funny how commissions come to you. For a long stretch of time, you have like zero, and then all of a sudden, everyone wants something at the same time. Which is fine with me. It's just the heavy load of watercolor pieces I have lined up. Um, although fun has been super daunting for some reason. I would assume because most of them are free for all in the category of nature and space. Uh, they kind of take a little bit longer. Uh, as well, they're paying for an idea. Coming up with ideas can sometimes take a while. One digital commission I'm struggling with pretty bad, uh, the, even though the concept is simple. And then again, the logo, which has guidelines, but it's still up to me mostly. So again, add that to the list of making things up. Therefore, it's going to take a little bit longer. So if you've commissioned me, thank you so much for your patience as the back load is quite a bit right now, but it's coming your way soon. Now that we got that covered, we can dive into this Thursday's video in the challenge series. As I stated last week, these next two last videos uh, have been shot on a short time frame um, in the middle of the night. <laughs> Not as much time has been put into them due to commission work and general mental health stuff. But we're here with this lemon video. I must say I quite enjoy just painting a lemon. As I was short on time, I didn't put much time into picking colors and going crazy. I just straight up painted lemons and a sneaky lime. Even though it was like 2 in the morning, I really enjoyed the process. Um... It was relaxing as I was tired, but I don't know. It's just something about lemon yellow. Oh, by the way, using lemon yellow on a lemon. Ooh, uh, it's just, I don't know. Instead of being like bright and obnoxious, it's just, it's kind of, I don't know. It was relaxing to me at the time. I was like, I like working with this. So yeah, excuse me if my voice is not the same. I just, I, uh, I'm running on no sleep and I have so much to do. Um, so I'm just trying to <laughs> put this in here. Oh, but the only downside, I don't know if it's just my lemon yellow. It's probably just my lemon yellow. But for some reason, it always gets, gets these uh, dark specks in it. It's probably, like, obviously from combining with other colors, but it's like, no matter how much I clean it, it's like, there it is again. You know, it's, I don't know what's wrong with it, or like, why it keeps happening. And I have two lemon yellows, and I think both of them do the same thing. I don't know. I must say, I'm struggling with commentary on this one, and also probably the next one, because again, I am so out of it, I am so sorry, um, that going out with a bang isn't really what we, we're gonna do here. <laughs>
and this oh this part i really really like this part it's like when i paint the uh little pulps of the lemon it's uh very like that process itself was so relaxing And it really gives it that texture, I guess, of like, yeah, that's that's a lemon. That's what that is. Something I've noticed, though, is, like, when I go in for highlights, um, they don't really show up that well. I don't know why, but I don't know. So that uh, it's kind of pointless when I go in at, at the end with it, but... I'm just quite literally just watching the video myself and trying to add commentary, but nothing is happening in my brain right now, <laughs> but I'm like mesmerized. <laughs> um, hopefully you're just enjoying the music for most of it. nearing the end of the video thank you so much for watching and i'll see you in the next one